Well, the kids are off to school and uh, I'm on my way fishing. There's my fishing pole right there. I got some uh, filled up with gas already. I'm supposed to meet uh, this co worker, uh, Rick, out there. He gets off in the morning. He says he's heading out there like 8 or something, so I don't know. It's 8 o'clock right now. But uh, yeah, we'll be out there pretty soon. Let's see if we can get some uh, lip ripping going on. Oh yeah, we heading down the freeway. Yeah, we're gonna be heading way out that way. Pretty soon. Lee route there's all get all these Joshua trees out here what's well, mixed in with the uh, juniper but there's tons of them out here bro there's the lake oh yeah check it out folks about to be dipping my line in there well I made it out here oh, I forgot my coffee damn well just uh, finished my coffee <laughs> I thought there was more in there than that it was, but it wasn't, so. Anyways, I'll turn around my thing and show you the view I got. Check it out, y'all. I'm gonna just go right here and look, and I think I'm gonna walk down that way and go all down there. But I'm just gonna go over here and take a look, see what's popping. Well, here's the view of this uh, Quail Lake. That's, that section that goes into the uh, aqueduct. I got my uh, Abu Garcia and uh, Matasas lure. It's kind of big, so hopefully you get it bigger the bait, the bigger the fish, right? Uh, I thought I had more. I thought I had more uh, lures, but I forgot I took the that box of lures out. I'm glad I grabbed this, at least this one, uh, before I left the house. Cause that was like a, my God, dude, like 30 minute, no, like a 40 minute drive. But yeah, I'm gonna go back around. We're gonna walk down the fence line and then get down there further. So we'll get back to you. Yeah, so now we're uh, just hiking down this road. To go to the other end and, and uh, I think it's deeper over there. So uh, get back here when we get over there. I wonder if this used to be an old boat ramp or something. Now it's all washed out and stuff. Something. Anyways, here's some more view for y'all. This cool helicopter thing. I wonder if it was probably in some movie maybe. In this uh, cool house. Old house. It's pretty awesome. White hiking. <laughs> Look, that's where I was way, way back there. Way far back there. <laughs> I don't know. I think I walked like a, a mile already. I don't know. Keep hiking all the way down here and I'm down around. And to get over. Over. Over this way, maybe get going down over here, so we'll uh, keep on trucking. I'll try and I'll try and get uh, get on the other side when I leave, if I can go that way. But uh, that side's kind of curvy, the road is, and this road on this side's uh, straight, so it gets just a straight path down over there. Well, I just talked to uh, this guy right there, Steve. He said that. Uh, this morning they were like 7:30. They're boiling over here in this this cove right here, and then uh, over there on that side too. But then he got he went. By the time he got over here, they were done. But I think he was coming from the front anyway, so it takes freaking a long time anyways. But let's go over here and take a look and see, see what's up. 
Check out that view, folks. That's a good little spot. So I came from, uh, uh, let's see, I think clear down here, about clear down there, there's, I don't know if you see that road down there that's going up the hill maybe, let me try to zoom. Yeah, from right there, straight, right in there, I came from that area, so I don't know how far that is. Probably like a mile or two, I don't know, or a mile. I don't know, pretty damn far. <laughs> but the other side, you gotta, the road's all curvy, so it take you a long hike to get over there. Plus, I don't think you can cross right there, you can't cross right there. Where's that? Yeah, right there at the, those gates you can't cross because it's locked up. There's no, like, real bridge. I'm about to head over there. I got some uh, boiling action over here, so I'm gonna head over there. Check it out, we got some uh, boiling action out here. I don't know if I can throw it out that far, but. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, they were out, way out there beyond my reach. It's still cool though, you can see them. Too bad we could take a boat out there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that was pretty cool to see that uh, boil out there. Too bad they were uh, too far out. That would have been cool to catch one of them. But uh, they're still just a little bit too far on my side. Because I wouldn't have the, uh, the other lure I had. I probably would have made it a little bit by them. But this one's... Eh. Anyways, uh, yeah, it was pretty cool. Kind of died down a little bit. Every once in a few minutes, you could hear him slapping the water. That's pretty cool. Well, they're working their, their way that way. They're still a little bit uh, too far out for me to get, get them, but... Oh, well. I'm having fun anyways. I have a few uh, popping off right over here, but... Uh, now it seems like they're uh, down over here. I've seen a, f a few jumping, so... Hope we get one. They're boiling over by the dude. I think he got one. I'm not sure. A little bit closer to shore over there. Whatever. Small bird action. Well, it's a pretty nice day out today. Uh, not too many bites. I don't, I don't have the lure to get out there far enough. Maybe I should have got one of those bigger. Uh, Cast masters, that would have been cool. But yeah, there seems to be moving down along this. Uh, there's a jetty that runs along the side right here, but uh, that's a running around chasing the bait fish right there. So uh, we'll just keep following them down as far as we can get to them and see if we can get some action. So now they migrated uh, down this way right here. We were right here. That guy just caught that one right there. To 
Maybe that's a little dink, but whatever. They're popping off right there. down over there and then this is where they're hitting that out on the other side of these toolies right there you can't even get to that it's all underwater right there but it's still pretty cool I'm having an awesome day hell yeah I should be uh, do some culvert operation with my uh, float tube and get out there in the evening and nobody even know that'd be pretty funny oh yeah well I'm hiking it back but, uh, pretty cool. They're, they're heading down this way, so maybe by the time I get over there, maybe they'll be down there. We'll see. Well, that's uh, pretty much it. That's a pretty cool day with them seeing the boils out there. Next time I'm going to have to bring some, uh, make sure I have my uh, lures in the trunk. I, I don't mean I forgot I took them out, but. Anyways, at least I had grabbed that one. They were a little bit further out than I was anticipating, but uh, next time, I did see that guy catch that one, the little three pounder. But it's cool, man. I had an awesome day, so. All right, y'all, thanks for watching, and uh, catch y'all on the next one.